Justin Bonomo topped a field of 1,587 players in the 2014 World Series of Poker $1,500 Six Max No Limit Hold'em event, earning his first gold bracelet and the $449,980 first place prize. Just days earlier, the 28-year-old took second in the $10,000 Triple Draw Low Ball event, falling short of his first career bracelet for the third time. We asked him about his experience making it back to Heads Up for the fourth time and the wild ride he went through in this event. Um, it just felt so incredibly surreal. Um, you know, three days ago, I'd basically just resigned and said, you know what, second place, you know, no bracelet, but it's a good finish. You know, I just got to stop caring about the bracelet. It's not that big of a deal. And then next thing I know, the next tournament I enter, I'm heads up again, which is just mind blowing already. Um, and the way it went down, uh, Sowers was just crushing the field. We went from 10 to two players in literally two hours, which I mean, I was just thinking about the pay jump at that point. I went from 40K to 280K. And then heads up, I have a three to one ship deficit. I got very lucky to catch some cards. Um, basically doubled up without a showdown, just winning a bunch of medium pots. And then in a huge three bet pot, I river to gutter, which is, you know, the luckiest miracle card I could have asked for. Um, then after that, things took a turn for the worse. Sowers had 25,000 chips. I had him out chipped 300 to one. He climbed all the way back to five to one. And I was just preparing myself mentally to tell like the worst bad beat story in the history of poker. Uh, fortunately, I was able to close it and obviously uh, win my first bracelet and I just couldn't be happier. In interviews after he finally won, Bonomo told the press that the heads up battle this time around was surprisingly emotional. We asked him to explain why. Um, I'm not an emotional person at all, but it's just the way that it went down. I mean, I, I was a 300 to 1 favorite to win a bracelet, and then I just saw it slipping away. Like, I literally almost started tearing up after he caught uh, a straight on the river to get to 1.2 million chips. Like, I, I just had the most pessimistic thoughts in my head you can imagine. And, um, it, it's weird, actually. I didn't think I'd have all these negative emotions with winning a bracelet, but it just so much stress the way it went down. And, it was incredible. After all of the stress, we asked Bonomo how it felt to have earned the title and the bracelet. Does he feel more relaxed now that he's gotten the monkey off his back? Yeah, absolutely, especially that my success came so early in the World Series, like it'll be pretty impossible for me to have a losing World Series, so it's nice to make for a stressful month and a half, or sorry, a stress-free month and a half. Um, I'm, I'm not gonna work my butt off and like, dedicate myself to player of the year or anything i'm still gonna enjoy life try to be healthy take time off for edc but uh obviously i'll keep playing events as well congratulations once again to justin bonomo champion of the 1500 dollars six max no limit hold'em event and proud new owner of a wsop gold bracelet <laughs>